Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com with a three box break of 2019-2020 Panini Contenders Basketball. Yes, we can chase Kobe Bryant autos along with Zion, John Moran, RJ Barrett, so on and so forth. It's a lot of great stuff. No vet comments shipped, two autographs a box. Um, so let's get after it. Good luck. Big thanks to this group for making it happen. Thanks to the people who bought their spot straight up. Congrats again to the winners uh, of spots in those Flux Basketball Breaks. All 30 basketball teams are in. Let's roll it and randomize it. One and a two. Three times for names and teams. One, two, and three. After three, we got Jeremy Carson down to Andrew. And one and a two. Three times for the teams. Good luck. One, two, and three. We got the Pacers up top. The Wizards on the bottom. And here's how it shakes out. All right, Jeremy with the Pacers, Ryan with the Magic, Jeremy with the Suns, Chad with the Hornets, John with the Clippers, Kirk with the Celtics, John with the Heat, and my Lakers. Jeremy with the Jazz, Andrew with the T-Wolves, Matt with the Raptors and the Warriors and the Rockets, Darren with the Knicks, Frank with the Thunder, Eric with the Bulls, Russell with the Trailblazers, Kenneth with the Nuggets, Andrew with the Sixers, Matt with the Kings, Andrew with the Spurs, Matt with the Grizz, uh, Steven with the Pistons, Matthew with the Hawks, Tristan with the Cavs, Ryan with the Bucks, Matt with the, uh, uh, sorry, getting mixed up by these two Matts, Matt Johnson with the Brooklyn Nets, Matthew Silverstein with the Pelicans, John Jackson with the Mavs, and Andrew Wu with the Washington Wizards. Wu, Washington Wizards, good alliteration there. All right, now we are going to pause the video just for a little bit, see if there's any trades when we come back. We'll, uh, we'll have the break. So we're going to pause, stick around, be right back. All right, unpause. Welcome back to the other side of the trade window. There you go, gang. Right here on a Wednesday, three box break from a fresh case. Now, I, I honestly don't remember how common Kobe autos were back then. I don't think very common. If we find one in this three box break, we'd be, we'd be uh, pretty lucky. We should all go buy lottery tickets. We ripped a ton of this stuff back in the day. All right, first of all, we're gonna see which column we're gonna do. And then we'll see which, uh, we'll do top three or bottom three. All right, so one, two, three for the left column, four, five, six for the right side right here. And it's three, left side, one, two, three, and we'll save these for something else some other time. All right, now we've got three boxes up top. That's one, two, three. And then three boxes on the bottom. That'll be four, five, and six. One, two, three. Top three boxes. All right. Good luck, everybody. There it is, two autographs per box on average. Yeah, contenders basketball, we don't see too often. So I'm surprised we saw it on the site. Should have gone, I feel like it should have sold out a little more quickly, but 
maybe people weren't really into it as much as, as much as I was. Pretty familiar design though. So these are the commons, those won't show. Oh yeah, they put blank cards in there. I forgot about that. Team quads. And then obviously this Zion insert will ship. That'll be for the Pelicans, that'll be for Matthew, Matthew S. And LeBron James, superstar die cut. I feel like back then, these I don't know how well these do now in the secondary market, but I feel like back then they would they would do pretty well. Some of these could be numbered too, it increases the value. So most of these are just gonna be commons. Team quads for the Lakers, nice. LeBron, AD, Danny Green, Kyle Kuzma. Should have kept that team together. Uh, Lakers like to tinker. This will obviously ship. De'Aaron De Fox, nice. Fox in the box out of 125. Kings definitely have the Lakers number here. I mean, these might, these vet commons, I don't know. I don't know if these will even, even help me survive under the bridge. It came to that. There's R.J. Barrett. He's pretty good. I feel like he still, still has room to grow. That'll be for the Knicks. Knicks edition going to Darren. And, ah, I thought that was going to be an autograph. Rookie of the Year contender. Uh, we haven't seen an autograph yet. Kobe White, who's actually been playing some good hoops this year. Eric K. We're, we're running out of cards. Where are the autos? There's PJ Washington. Anthony Davis to 199. And no autos? Mm -hmm. There's AD to 190. What, what about that computer? Sorry, it's still not printing right now. No, it's not. No autos. <laughs> Panini, yeah. We're supposed to, it says on average. They're going to tell us it was just a below average box. All right. Maybe this one will have four autographs. Let's balance it out. Let's hope for some better results in this box here is Cameron Johnson. Darius Garland. All right, there's an auto right here. Rookie ticket autograph, Tremont Waters. For Boston, that's going to be for Kirk, last spot mojo. And we got a one of one Bruno Fernando rookie autograph. Just marinating in here since 2019. That is for Matthew Silverstein and the ATL. Matt, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. 
What's Bruno Fernando doing these days? <laughs> Derek's like, WTF, where is Bruno Fernando? I mean, he's still with the, well, no. <laughs> okay, so he went to the, he's, he was with the Atlanta Hawks from 2019 to 2021, played 2019 in college with, for the College Park Skyhawks, then went to the Celtics, who promptly put him with the main Celtics. Then he was with the Rockets for a season, right, just on their bench, I guess. And then he's back to the Atlanta Hawks in 2023 and is with the College Park Skyhawks G League team. So yeah, so they, they looks like looks like he's still no wrong John wrong David, not at the Ace Hardware Store, not playing golf, with the Atlanta Hawks playing for their G League team. So put some respect on Bruno's name. Still in the league, grinding. Meanwhile, you jerks making fun of him. He's probably, he's watching the stream right now. He's like, listen, I'm trying to chase the dream. to call them trash, but they're still professional yeah, players. Yeah, still pros. Still a pro. It's Donovan Mitchell to 125 for the Jazz. Jeremy Carson. Man, the disrespect for Bruno Fernando. On that one of one. All right, there's Luka Doncic. Second year Luka Doncic to 149. Dallas Mavericks, that'll be for John Jackson. Uh, Matt McClung, I did pull a Matt McClung like rated rookie card earlier today in a different break. He's uh he's on a G League team. Just dunking on G Leaguers. Alright, so we got two autographs in this box and a one of one. But yeah, it'd be cool to see him. Lakers had him for half a second. Sixers had him for half a second. He's, he's kind of popped up and down. And we got a Lakers die cut. We got a LeBron in the first box, and we got a AD superstar die cut in the second box. These used to uh, these used to do well in the secondary market. Not sure what they do now, but people like these. A lot, of, a lot of grading points, though. It's kind of hard to grade. All right, so third and final box. Good luck, everybody. Oh, he's with Orlando G League team now. Mac McClung. He has the highest points per game in the G League. He's probably not making that, that Magic team, though. I'm... He should, they should try to, he should move somewhere else. What's like a not good team with no guards that could use some butts and seats? Maybe the Wizards should get him. And just have him put on a highlight show 30 minutes a night. Just him and Kuzma. They, no defense, a lot of offense. That'd be a fun team to watch actually. You know, and then you put some butts in seats. <laughs> Come see Mac McClung, dunk contest winner. They'll just run plays where they can just do trick plays, you know, like, you know, that you can have, you can have Kuzma run the break and he's flying down, down the court. You know, Mac McClung will be a trailer you know, and then Kuzma just stops and flips the ball. So he's running, stops, flips the ball back to Mac McClung. Mac McClung gets it, takes it off of Kuzma, flies over Kuz, slam dunk, people on their feet. Oh, Jordan Poole's there too? That's right, Owen. I'll, I'd go watch some Wizards basketball if I'm in DC. And you got that trio out there, just putting up, you know, just putting up 140 a night and losing by, <laughs> losing by 20 points. 
It'd be 160 to 140. Ah, David Robinson. David Robinson autograph. Nice. I was like, is that just an insert here to fool me? Or is this the Admiral? It is. That's Andrew with the Spurs. Legendary contenders autograph. Nice. That's eight out of 49. The Michael Porter Jr. will go to Denver. That's going to go to Kenneth. And here's a Bradzikis, Ignas Bradzikis, uh, Contenders Optic autograph. That'll be for New York. That's our second auto. That's going to go to Darren. Nice, David Robinson. Cam Reddish. Lakers picked up a lot of dudes from that 2019 class. They got Reddish on that team. There's Lonnie Walker the fourth. They had Lonnie Walker the fourth like last year. I really love love that 2019 draft class. And here is lottery ticket Ja Morant. That's going to go to Memphis. That's going to go to Matt. Let's see if we can find a bonus auto out of here. There's Larry Bird. Legendary contenders. Not numbered. That almost looks like it should be a one-of-one one foil, right? It's not. Ooh, here's something nice. Ooh, I don't know what these do on the secondary market these days, but here's a Zion Williamson superstar die cut. That's worth a look up. Matthew with the Pelicans. Well, maybe they're, they're not as, not what they once were, but I remember at the time, people really used to like these superstar die cuts. All right, so some nice, some fun stuff popping out of here. Here's Ben Simmons to 149. Ben Simmons, done? I think he's he's down with another injury. Nerve injury or something like that? That should probably take him out the rest of the season. We've got a Tyler Hero lottery ticket car that's going to go to John in the Heat. All right, and that, my friends, is that. Not a bad break, three box break, 2019-2020 Contenders Basketball. Didn't see the big hitters, the big players, but maybe we'll, maybe we'll find them some other time. I'm Joe. I'll see you next time for the next break. Bye-bye.